Yo, today we're checking out Freerun episode three, and I can't wait to see where Freerun and Fran are gonna go on their journey. Let's go. All right, man. Let's let's give it a look, dude. Let's see. Uh, let's see how they're all doing, dude. The two of them are doing. How much magic Fern has has learned? You know, she's been training. Oh wow, she's just as tall as her. Taller. Hmm. This is cool. Oh, she's lying. She's definitely lying. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, is that what she... Oh, boy. <laughs> Yeah, that that one that one definitely helps. She's off to buy something unnecessary. <laughs> Poor Fern, bro. Having to keep this elf in line, dude. Of course. <laughs> Maybe buying something for her? I think she's buying something for Fern. It's for her. It's... It's definitely for her. It's even in a nice little gift box. Big decision. It's not for her. Oh. It's definitely for Fern and her. Because remember, she wants to make more memories. She wants to learn more about humans, you know what I mean? Oh, what the heck? Oh, what's going on here? This looks unsavory. <laughs> right? Bro, even the bartender <laughs> looks hard as hell, dude. <laughs> no, they don't. Bruh. He's probably talking about women. Look at this dude laughing, bro. He's probably talking about the red light district. Come on, dude. That's what that's the sugar he's talking about. He's going to end up in a brothel. There's no doubt in my mind. Did they really give her good instructions? Like good directions or no? She never found it. Maybe she did and she just didn't buy the sweets yet. Because she wants him to go eat at the bakery. Okay. So she did find it. I wonder if they gave her the right directions. So they did give her good directions. Wow. I'm sorry for doubting those adventures. Aww. So she cherishes the time she spends with her comrades, man. Ooh. Pudding sounds good. He's remembering a... Really cool. I love when this series does this. A man like sour grapes? <laughs> yeah, don't make that your identity, bro. Oh, she got some pancakes. It was for her. Cool. Oh, happy birthday. A hair, a hair uh, clip. Hair ornament. This show is so wholesome, bro. Man, it has such a good, like, warm vibe to it, you know? A, a, a warm feeling to it. Or they heading off, too. 
Yo. That's so, so cool looking, man. I already love their little relationship. Right. Absolutely. Just trying to perceive and understand all this, you know? I really like this series, man. Just the first three episodes alone. Yo. Gotta protect yourself. Oh, it pierced it or it went around it. Wow. Woo! Smart. Smart. Well, she's just flinging spells at her, dude. Gotta get that endurance up. That was cool to see. Why this village? Oh. Oh. No scrolls? Okay. So why is she here? Oh, she ain't, they know her, bro. She has a reputation. Is that the demon lord? Qual? Oh. Elder Sage of Corruption? Oh, so was that the demon lord or just one of his generals? Oh! Oh, what? Oh, Dude, are we really gonna see this? Yo. Look at that thing's grin. Please let us see that. Please let us see that. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Hence the seal. だからこそ、その強さが頭になった。本当に魔法師読んでいないんだね。ノープ。今から読みます。いや、いいよ。しっかり睡眠を取る方が大事だ。どうせ明日にはわかる。She's gonna be there for the fight, I guess, bro. Is she gonna take part in it? Is she gonna be able to defend against it with her defensive magic? Because Zoltrak goes through defenses, right? Yo, this is about to be clean and sick, bro. I can only imagine what this is going to look like. Because the animation has been so cool up until now. How is this thing going to react? How is it going to act? Ooh, yo. Okay, so he's... So they were able to kill the Demon King, but they weren't able to kill this guy, who I assume is a general of the Demon King? Oh, yeah, they seem like they were comrades. She blocked it. That's why Freewin has had her doing defensive spells the whole time. Let's go! Let's go! Impenetrable defense. Oh, is it obsolete because it was 80 years ago? Is it like no longer like really relevant because stronger spells have come along? But it's not anymore. They, they found a way. To combat it. They adapted. That's so cool. You're obsolete, buddy. Hence Fern saying that. Wow. Exactly. 
おとなしくしていれば楽に殺してやる。攻撃魔法に同調し、威力を分散させる仕組み。Oh, is he gonna develop something right now? 複雑な術式じゃの。保証費もさぞつらかろう。おお。魔法の弱点に気づかれた。ヘル、対処できる。Is it gonna be a battle of attrition? Oh, dude, clean. Right, pinpointing where it's gonna hit. Sick. Holy shit. Yeah, Fern, let's go. Yo. Yo. Oh, she's using her own Zolt track. Damn! Holy shit! You can see the cavern underneath the ground, can't you? Oh, Fern's hunched over. You have? When he was younger? Yo. Oh, <laughs> he was trying to get a peek. I mean, I'm not condoning it, but oh, we saw that before. Yeah. Didn't we see that before? I kind of remember this scene. Maybe not. I thought it was one of their memories last episode. That's funny, dude. So he's like 90 something years old then, or 86, right? Hmm. Believed in his friend, bro. I think he had feelings for her too, but I could be wrong. Hmm. Wow. This episode went by fast. For a show that doesn't have a lot of action in it and is more character driven and character focused and focuses on like the events and whatnot, that went by fast, bro. I mean, the fight was crazy, right? But everything else was really immersive as well. I think that's the best way to put it. This show so far in these first three episodes, the immersion is absolutely on point. I would love to hear your thoughts on this episode. As always, thank you for watching and until next time.